face value and place value story long time ago the world was a small place human beings birds and elements of nature coexisted in harmony and even talked to each other on one hot summer noon a farmer was working in the field the scorching sun was on his head and the soil was broiling his feet that day the unbearable heat made the farmer angry with sun he scolded sun how dare you trouble me so much it's better you never show your face again the sun was sad he selflessly moved around the world from morning till evening in order to provide light and warmth your face value is your light and warmth share it selflessly and you will be blessed the revered sage had told him however he was being admonished he decided not to come out of his house the next day as he never wanted to go through the level of agony again next morning everyone slept till late as the rooster did not crow finally they knew something was wrong there was darkness all around even moon was not there as he had completed his scheduled travel the situation went on for some days the cold increased to freezing point devoid of light plants and trees withered finally all representatives decided to call sun for meeting the sun was dim due to grief he explained them about his decision everyone requested sun to reconsider his decision the sun said what is my use i disturb you from your sweetest dreams every morning no said the farmer who was feeling embarrassed how will i know that i need to go to fields if i don't get the signs of dawn he continued With sunrise we begin scouting for food said the bird and i take my cattle to graze continued the herdsman and i open temple with your vision my lord said the priest the sun softened in that case i should not generate the kind of heat which you feel in the noon Having heard this the cloud and river appeared suddenly and said our existence depends on this heat of noon and we ripen in that heat only said rice how will we know when to take lunch for our husband in fields said the wives the sun was getting enlightened He again reasoned the time between noon and evening is a prolonged time i should go home directly after noon the bird said but we need to know when to return home to our kids we are guided by evening for this others too endorsed his views and we need to be prepared to scout around for a prey tiger and owl spoke together i can't travel for 18 hours walking for 12 hours itself is tiresome said the moon sun still seemed confused then the sage
spoke. Dear son, warmth and light are something you always carry. This is your face value. He further continued, however, with the change of place, that is, east during sunrise, overhead during noon, and west during sunset, your value also changes. You are important for some at one place and for others at different place. This is your place value. Continued the revered sage. You can't ignore your place value at any place or time. You are important everywhere, said the sage and blessed the sun. The sun was happy now and blessed the entire universe again with its light and heat. Happy learning!